Hey, what's up, everybody? Hey, uh, I just ha having some issues with my phone, so I took it down to the Sprint slash T-Mobile store, and they inform me that right now there's a national issue that is known that is being prepondered by either TikTok or Gmail or both. It affects random phones. If you go to check your email or go get on TikTok or get on other apps, it kicks you right back out of them and will not let you use them. Um, but they said it is a known issue and they are working on getting it fixed. But it's nothing on the network's end, it's on the app's end. So it's something that apps are having to work on. Also, if um, you are a Sprint customer and you get asked by Sprint if you've gotten your T-Mobile SIM card yet, tell them you do not want the T-Mobile SIM card. The reason why I say that is the SIM card for T-Mobile um, slows your phone down to like 2G. It's been reported in other places on the internet, but I was talking to another customer in line today and I was telling about my issue when I got my T-Mobile SIM card. I put it in my phone and instantly I could not send pictures and messages anymore. And um, as soon as I put my old SIM card back in, they sent the picture sent right away. So it was definitely an issue with the SIM card. And when I was explaining that to them, they said, yeah, we, we saw an article about that on the net that the new T-Mobile replacement SIM cards for Sprint customers actually slow the phones down to 2G and did not give you the 5G like you had before. So my advice is leave your Sprint SIM card in your phone as long as possible. I mean, if one day it automatically just shuts down and won't let you use the phone at all, then that's when you put the T-Mobile SIM card in and uh, go after them for not giving you your 5G that you paid for. But use that Sprint SIM card as long as possible. Anyway, just wanted to pass on the information I got today. Hope you guys are having a great day. Be safe out there. Wear your mask.